What's going on YouTube? Bent Crypto here. Figured I'd make a little video today. Um, sure everybody what's going on with me and stuff. So I went in and bought Neo at at like zero zero two one uh six something. So I'm up about like five percent so far. So it's not bad. The 1334 about to cross on the daily, probably probably t by tomorrow or Wednesday. So it's still not too late to kind of at least watch or jump in. Um, but that's 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 ultimately up to you. Um, still a quality buy, even if you're hodling it. You'll be accumulating gas, which which would make sense too, because gas. Gas is another thing that that uh, was at least like eighty bucks at one point too. So, and and Neo was at two hundred at one point. So, there's a lot of room for it. Yeah, and this looks like this this is about to cross as well. So, gas might be another another interesting buy as well. So, um, I'm actually going to be looking into that. I didn't even realize that. So, anyways, uh, moving on to Ethereum. I finally got my Cobras ready. To lay an egg because I, they got too much stuff here, man. I can't, I can't be like all over the place with this stuff. So, I'm about to lay this egg. It looks like you need five levels. It takes five levels away from your mom to, excuse me, to lay an egg. So, I'm just gonna lay my egg. I'm gonna wait for that uh, egg to hatch. But actually, this is this is the first time I'm actually going through this. This is why I wanted to. To show you guys what's going on. So, anyways, I'll wait for that to get through. This is what's up with, with Ethereum, Ethereum network. But um, but yeah, once that goes through, hopefully I should be I should have an egg. Then once I get the egg, I should be able to hatch it. And if it's the same thing as this guy here, I might I might even sell this guy and just work with the egg because I think he's worth a lot right now. Um, and we could even look at the market, but I think he'd be worth a lot because I'd be mop I'd be mopping up people online with him. Like he's def like I think he's maybe lost like maybe ten times since I played with him, since I've had him, and that's and that's that's not much at all. So he's not even really worth he's not really worth that much. But these are level ones. So I mean, if we look at let's see if we can find somebody that's near my level. No, nah, so I mean, if I sell him, there's none at level 35, so I could definitely get some good money. Look at this point not zero nine. Look, he's at level one, oh, level 30 right here. Point two three e. That's not bad. Uh oh, failed. So, anyways, that's what I'm trying to do right now. I'm trying to use these like little D apps, take my time with them, uh, get them up there. And then and sell them, trying to make some money. I also can, um, I also can sell my my emots. Where's it right here? My emot right here. I could also sell them and get uh, and get some cash for that too. Actually, let me check the worth of it because I know Ethereum kind of went up today. What's this? Oh, there's a new one. Oh, they did something new. Anyways, so it looks like where, oh, I got it. Okay, connect wallet. Meta mask. Oh, they must have added a new wallet. Okay. Anyways, so what is it worth here? What is it trading at? Where's the price at? Am I blind or something? Do I not see it? Oh, it's U.S. dollars. That's why. Okay. Where Iman? I know how much I got. Oh, thank you. All right, so here's. Oh, but I want to sell. So let's just say I want to sell. Yeah. So I'm not really gonna get nothing right now. So I'm this this definitely I'm gonna wait. I think I think once a hard fork happens and like the Ethereum network actually is faster. Um. People are gonna start playing the DApps on here, and there was a there was a message. Damn, where is it? There was a message about 93% um, of da of Ethereum DApps uh, don't have any users. 
So imagine once like the network gets faster and people can start throwing the dApps on there. I mean, you saw how Ethereum blew up in the next, in the last day or so. So, I mean, there's a lot of potential around that. And I wouldn't be really too sleep on Ethereum, even though I did say you should probably sell Ethereum for um, or get out of Ethereum before the hard fork. But the hard fork actually might be a good thing because it looks like, I mean, crypto is kind of going into the dApp space right now. And it looks like, like Tron is kind of the front of that. And a lot of these other apps are trying to emulate the same thing. So the fact that Ethereum is already, you know, it's been a, to, a uh, top two crypto, really. It's been a top two coin uh, for a long time. I mean, I really don't see the hard fork killing it, I would say. It might just improve it, and especially like the PO, the the proof of, I think it's, it's going to be a PO, POS proof of stake. So as long as you're hodling it, you can gain more. And if you're playing these DApps and stuff like that, it's going to be it's going to just incentivize more people to hodl it because they're going to be playing these games. So yeah, man. Um, if anybody's interested in this stuff too, uh, links are in the description. I have plenty plenty of links in there if you're ever interested in any of them. Um, also, my Exosis is going really well. I found, I don't even want to, I didn't want to release this, but I found a, a pool where I've majority, of, I've been like the single miner for the most part. So I've been getting like 100% shares and getting like a good amount of these tokens per day. So I'm just going to be running this shit for the month of February, even probably March. I'm going to wait until things start heading more north and then hopefully be able to cash out. This is, um, I'm starting to, I'm starting to learn how, or I'm starting to become more patient in this crypto stuff because before, you know, before it was all about all oh, money, 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 uh, trying to get gains, trying to get profits right now. But you know what? It's all about m making educated decisions and then just being patient about it because there's a lot of times where I got in and I was like, yes, it's a good project. And then I was like, you know what? Maybe it's not. And it, I didn't even take a day. Maybe it's not sold. And then the next week it blows up 50%, you know? So sometimes it's just all about patience, trusting yourself. You know, as long as you do your due diligence and you do your research and you set your stop losses for sure. Set your stop losses for sure, but um, but yeah, it depends on on what you want to do, and yeah. Bank crypto, here and out. I'll be making another video soon. Take care, guys.